with a shit ton of perks and greenery. There's lots of nature in the city, which is why Angus is called the Green City. Right. I already think I said that. I think the bills are kicking in. I took some message apps before coming in to do the narration. Never buy trucks off a stranger, kids. Built between the 11th and 16th century, and this is the Cathedral St. Marie's. Originally dedicated to the Virgin Mary, the dedication to St. Marie's and St. Marie's were later added. During the Middle Ages, the St. Marie's Cathedral stated they were in possession of St. John the Baptist's head. However, this proved to be only a rumor. Inside stands its two distinctions. There's the windows and the pipe organ. The windows of the cathedral are considered to be a masterpiece of French 13th century glass work. The organ has been around since the 1300s. However, the one you see here has only been around since 1617. There was another organ made before, but in 1451, it was struck by a lightning bolt. Yes, a motherfucking lightning bolt. The masonry atom may seem like a regular medieval half-timbered house, but that's because it is. However, since there are not that many of them, this house is special. Also known as the Tree of Life, it lies in the intersection of Montauk Street and Blaise St. Croix, just behind the Cathedral St. Maurice. Built in 1491, the house depicts the story of Adam and Eve, but unfortunately, the house was vandalized during the French Revolution by revolutionaries. Fucking bitches. They fucked up that house. Since 1922, the house has been considered a historical landmark. There are a total of six levels in the Mason Nevada. The ground floor, three top floors, and, not, and, and two attic floors. There are lots of other specifications of the house. But there's no footage of that. And just during the night is something different. The nights are usually filled with silence, except for a few trucks yelling in the street after drinking all night. During the night, you also have a few kebab restaurants open. But other than that, there's not much of a nightlife except for a couple of nightclubs and a couple of bars, which all close at two in the morning. Oh, the rest 
restaurants close early, and all the stores close even earlier. Gonna lie down here a little. Mm. 